Welcome back everyone to Minecraft. I'm just cooking up some beef. There's the beef. And uh, let me go show you what I got. See what I got in my hand? See what I got in my hand right here? I went and found me some dark oak. I don't know if I had that last time in the in the video. So I've been working on planting some dark oak trees. Um, any of you server folk, uh, if you could hold off on, if, if you want to borrow some saplings, hold off for just a little bit. Um, because I know these are hard to find. It's, I believe the dark oak forest is over that way. Um, I can't remember exactly though. Uh, let me, let me work on getting more saplings because as you know, dark oak are kind of obnoxious because like one tree might only give you three saplings and it takes four saplings to build a dark oak. So, um, but you can also see I've chopped down a bunch of the trees up here. Um, this is going to become my dark oak farm. It's kind of hard to grow dark oak trees when you got other trees around. I am leaving that one though, because that one's probably going to stay. That will be the staple of this uh, little mountain island up here. So let's go down and let's talk about some stuff. Uh, today's going to be kind of a short episode, or this week rather. This will probably be the only episode this week. Because I've got lots of busy work to do, right? You know? i got lots of stuff that's been cooking. Beef. Chicken. I had to get another chest. Still, though, only one diamond. I've got five emeralds, but only one diamond so far, which is okay. Uh, so I've started um, to started decorating with some trees around here. I made the cow, <laughs> the cow stable, uh, air, it's stable, the cow area, whatever you call this, uh, cow field, better, bigger, more cows, thus where the beef came from. And apparently they're having a pool party. Yeah. Uh, so... I'm really happy with the way this turned out. You know, I, I wanted something that was a little bit amorphous and simple. That's just the way I usually do my my farms and stuff. And that I, I just love the big spruce trees. It, these trees, I should not be, you know, a third the height of a tree. At least not all trees. So uh, you'll be seeing me use a lot of the tall oak trees or spruce trees. I will, however, be cutting those down. Um, because I need the wood, uh, but they're there for now for decoration. And then I'll replant them once I get these seeds from them. So let's talk about what we want to do. Um, what I, what I want to do in the future with building and what our first project is going to be. Um, I've gone ahead and lit up and put torches all over the place, like out to about here and up into those mountains all across there, as you can probably see. Uh, but the thing I need to do before I start building is get organized. And so the first thing I'm going to build is a storage shed. And I've decided kind of on the look we're going to go for. I'm not, I'm not like going with a like super specific theme as I've kind of done in the past. I'm just going to build and see what I like with the storage shed and then base the ev everything else off of that is kind of what I'm going to go with. You know, sometimes we say, oh, I'm going to go for a, uh, what do you call it? Uh, what do you call that? That art style? The, uh, the, uh, steam, steampunk style or fantasy. I mean, with Minecraft, everything's kind of fantasy. I mean, you can try and do modern, but that's not my style. So it is going to be a fantasy style, but I don't know what color scheme and stuff yet. Uh, still got lots of trees over here to cut down, but we will get to this area. This will be our, this will be our little town housing district. Um, or maybe the houses will be up there. I'm also kind of thinking maybe go not Viking style look. But kind of the idea of like uh, Burke from How to Train Your Dragon. Do something kind of like that. Houses on the sides and up on the hills and stuff. I definitely want to put into practice something I learned a long time ago, which is building into the terrain and not morphing the terrain too much. So, for instance, one thing I'm going to do is actually right here. Let me show you. We're going to go ahead and do this. And I got a bucket. Perfect. That's what I needed. Um, although I actually need another bucket. Or I need it. Oh, there's water down there I can get. Um, let's go ahead and make an infinite pool here, though. Um, if I'm able to. We'll put one there. Let me go get some more water. Oh, I need to eat. Um, but one thing, I, one thing I like doing is I like leaving the terrain alone. You know, making it maintain its naturalness. So what we do is we look at the terrain and go, okay, well, this is what was automatically generated. What does it look like was supposed to happen here? And if you look here, right in this spot, see how the water just comes here and stops. But then you see that area right there. That's like dug out that to me screams. Oh, this is supposed to be a little waterfall right here. So that's what we're going to do today. That's our one little project we're going to do today because this is a really, really easy project to complete. Um, and then 
after that, I'll have to get to work and then thinking about where I want to put the, uh, where I want to put the, uh, storage house. And the storage house is going to be kind of like off the beaten path, like maybe even on the other side over there across a bridge. And so we'll have a bridge be a part of the project and it's kind of run down. Cause I'm, I'm also kind of thinking I played a lot of, uh, banished a while back when banished first came out and like, you've got that storage shed. That's like, like I envision it being really rickety and stuff. All right. Is that infinite now? Yes, it is good. Okay. So let's get this kind of full. So it looks kind of like that. And actually I kind of want to put, no, that's fine. That's fine. Right there where like it is. Um, let's go ahead and put one here as well. I think maybe put one here. Yeah. Yeah. That's what we need it to look like. Cause, cause the flow is important to the immersion of it. Uh, because if I didn't explain last time, I am a, I am a builder. I'm not a redstoner. The only, the only real fancy thing I do is a big furnace. I, I'm, I'm dying without my big furnace right now, but I'm going to save that project for later. So let's see how this flows naturally. Okay. Not great right now, but let's put that there and then see what happens. Okay. That's going to auto fill in the stuff. That's okay. So we're flowing. We're flowing. We're good. Oh yes. Oh, excellent. Okay. So I don't like the way that this flowed here. So let's get some dirt and stop that up real quick. Um, how do I want to do this to be the most effective? Let's do this here. Whoops. And then this here. That'll change the flow for a minute. So I need to... Oh, except I need to put that there. There we go. Okay. Um, I need this to be gone and this to be gone, I think. And then it'll be okay. Whoops. And that can go back away. There we go. That's much better. It's not flowing down there. Can I fix that? Let's put this there and then break it away. Flowing water is odd in Minecraft. There we go. Oh, no, that's not going to get it. I would have thought that would have had it. All right, here's what we need to do. We need to do this. No. Oh, this. Let's do this. Nope, not that either. This. No. Actually, that's not bad. We'll put a we'll put a source there. It's all about knowing how to put your blocks. Um, you should be shorter. See, I, I would try to do this ahead of time and like say, okay, we're gonna build, we're gonna chop out this uh, dirt here, but it is so confusing trying to deal with that. Quiet phone. That's better. Is it just gonna stay like that? I guess it will. So I guess this needs to be dropped down more and block this off real quick here. Block this off here. Now we can do that and that and that. That's much better. That's a much better looking waterfall. I think. Yeah, look at that. That's nice. That's really, really nice. I'm really happy with that. Um, I'm questioning whether I should put a source block on this side. No, no, I like how it divots down. Um, okay, so I do need source blocks down here, however. So let's go get some more water in our bucket. I always love starting out my builds by making sure the terrain looks the way I like. So I'm glad I chose this to be our first little project together. Um, because we do want this water. Oh, by the way, we're going to have this water flowing all the way down into the river. That's right. Um, I don't know what that's going to do with that. That might make that a little odd and interesting. We might have to block that off. Actually, let's let's go ahead and plan that out real quick. So let's go ahead and take this as our 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 idea. Oh, I'm about to have to go sleep. And we'll chop down these trees as well. Got to keep track of the time because I got to go pick up my son from school. Oh, cool. Um, cool. My wife can pick up my daughter. Perfect. So that gives me a little bit of extra time to record, but we got to hurry. We got to sleep. Nighttime she cometh. So I've been really enjoying getting back into Minecraft. It's, it's one of those games that, you know, I can guarantee you after about a year or two of this max of a year or two, <laughs> I will be tired of it and stop for a while and then I'll come back and then I'll stop for a while. It's just one of those things. Now, maybe not, maybe I'll stay inspired. Maybe, maybe, you know, this server will kick my butt enough into gear that I'll be like, no, no, we're sticking with it for the long haul, baby. 
because it is a well viewed uh, uh, game on my channel. Um, it always has been. Granted, it's I mean it's Minecraft. Everybody loves Minecraft. It has nothing to do with me. It's, it's more to do with the game. So we want to carve out a waterfall of sorts here. And this sounds like a good way to do it. And actually, we're not going to have to cut down those trees. We're going to leave them right there as they are. And that'll be fine there. We're not going to go into the cave at all. We'll um, kind of... How does this want to turn? It wants to go this way and then that way, it looks like. So we will allow it to do that. Probably will work. Let's do this to make sure, because it might... Yeah, we'll do that, see how that does. And then from here, we'll go right into the water. Perfect. So it'll join up right there. Now let's start playing around with the water. Uh, first, can we make... We probably need more buckets to make an infinite source down here. Yeah, you can't really make that jump, can you? Still don't have an infinite source yet. I could just be smart and make a, you know, a 2x2 two two or a 1x3 hole and do it, but... Nah. Is that going to get it? That might have gotten it for that back one. Yes. Okay, good. Is that a source there now? Okay, that's a source there now. All right, let's put the source there. And a source. See, I want the flowing water. See, this is where it gets kind of difficult. Because you like the flow of the water, but you also need the sources to make it actually, you know, fill in. So, you can't have your cake and eat it too in Minecraft, apparently. Sorry, Mr. Sheep, you're just going to get swept down river. Like, literally, if you don't get out of that, you are going down river. Maybe we can name the river after you. Great, great, gray sheep canal. Or is that dark gray? Sorry to offend you if you're a dark gray sheep. I don't know if they get offended if you misguess their ethnicity. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Stupid things make me laugh. All right. So water should start flowing. Good. Yep, yep, yep. Good, good, good. Oh, look, it's already going down. Look at there. All right, well, let's put a source there. It didn't do what I expected it to do here, so let's build this up here a little better. Whoops. Let's have this maybe block it off there. Yeah, that's fine. That'll be good. Although I don't like that right there. Okay, that's just not going to go away. Um, so let's... If I do that, it's... No, it's still not pouring over. Now it's pouring over! Yeah! No, I really screwed it up now. Can I take that away? Yes, I can. Okay. That's fine. I like that. Oh, you block there. And it floweth perfectly. Look at that. Oh, let's pick up our sand. Sand is precious. Ah, we're full. All right, let's get rid of the chicken egg. I got plenty of chicken eggs. Cool. All right, well, let's take a look at it real quick before we say adios. Um, don't like how this looks here. So we need to, let's, we're going to cut down this tree. Was this an oak? Yeah. And build this out a little bit. Whoops. Not you. Yeah. I think we're okay with this corner being gone. I'm okay with that. Eh? Let me up. All right, cool. Oh, so now we got to worry about this side over here. Hold up. We're not done yet. Oh, and we need sources down there and this thing so that it doesn't try to flow, I think. Or maybe I need to just put... So I just need to put more up here. Help! Trying to swim. Oh, where did that one go? Not where I meant to click. All right, let's also help this out. Yeah, we're going to need this here. Oh yeah, let's let's get this built out a little bit. 
That's one thing we need. Not you. That's good. It's still flowing a bit too much in there, so I guess we need to... Oh, here's what we need to do. That's what we need to do. That's all it needed right there. Because I'm okay with this. I think that's cool. Um, let's empty out some of these. Give it a better look. Yeah! I'm feeling that. I like the flow as it's going to the waterfall. I like that I made the jump. Alright, well, let's uh, let's eat a steak real quick. And then let's uh, catch a glimpse of what we have created. Cool! I like it. Very neat. That, see, now that's what I'm talking about. This is one of those things where you look at a Minecraft world and you go, this looks like this should be this way, and you just fix it. Now, I would like that to maybe be winded a little bit different, maybe maybe branch it out. That's what it needs. We're going to do that before we go. I see exactly what it needs down here. Shush phone. People keep commenting. I'm, I'm just kidding. Comment, please. I don't mind my phone going bading during videos if it's you commenting. Um, <laughs> uh, we need this to like branch out that way and this way. Yes, 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 yes. Beautiful. Hello, bunny. Do you like it, bunny? I said, do you like it, bunny? Hmm. <laughs> He's backing away slowly from me. I'm not going to hurt you. All right, guys. Now we're done. I like that. That, well, I guess it didn't really change it. Well, I guess it, no, it did change it a good bit. We're going to get rid of that one. Can I make water flow there? No. But that will help. Let's let's do this instead. Let's do that right there. That's good. Well, I was wanting the water to flow a little differently. So let's put some water flow there and then get rid of it. There we go! Yes, 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 yes. Beautiful. That's what I was looking for. Alright, now let's go up high and take a look. Take a gander. Go from right. Well, I'm not going to be able to see it from here. Let's go up to there. Yeah, I'll go from right here. Yeah, that grass will grow there and it'll look better. Very nice indeed. I like it. It feels natural. It didn't... It, all I have to do is build a bridge here. And so what I think I'm going to get working on um, next time... And I'm, I may... I'm, I'm torn on how I want to do this series. Because here's the thing. I have time where I can play Minecraft but not record. I mean, as you can see, I've been playing and not recording. So I'm thinking of for some builds, like maybe for the... Maybe not for the storage shed, but maybe other things to do speed build videos where it's a sped up rendition of me building the things. Because... Because that's... Well, it's one of those things that some people like to see the building and some people like to just see the outcome. Some people like to see caving. Some people like to see PvP. I don't like PvP. Um... But I'm thinking of building the storage shed maybe over here. And so, so you know, people have to, like, go across and lug stuff back to to, to bring it and, and use it. And that's kind of what I want to experience is that idea of we put all the stuff over there. It doesn't really make much sense, but we built the storage shed there, so now we have to live with it. You know? We shall see. And I also like this area because I have a one colored grass over here and I have another colored grass over there. And then just beyond that is another colored grass. And then there's snow up there and lots of rock. And oh, I love this area. I love it so much. All right, guys, that'll do it for today. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. And we will see you guys next time on some more Minecraft on the NerdCraft server. No, NerdCraft, Craft Nerd. Craft Nerds. <laughs> I am going to say that wrong all the time. Just warning you. And that's okay. We'll see you guys next time. Adios. Goodbye.